Well, the MTA is moving forward with congestion pricing after a final vote to approve the controversial plan. But it's still facing fierce opposition as lawsuits continue to mount. CBS News' Christina Fan joins us live from the Upper West Side with a look at what is next. Christina. Mary and Chris, good morning. We are one step closer to turning these readers on. In a landslide vote Wednesday, MTA leaders decided just how much drivers will have to pay to enter Manhattan. But several lawsuits still stand in the way before congestion pricing can take effect in June. After five long years of bitter debate, a historic moment for New York City. The motion is approved. The MTA board voted in favor of implementing congestion pricing tolls for drivers to enter the central business district below 60th Street. Drivers will have to pay $15 during the day, trucks up to $36, motorcycles $7.50. Passengers and for hire vehicles will pay a $2.50 surcharge per ride. Taxi drivers will see a $1.25 surcharge. Oh, this is very bad. Absolutely is bad for everybody. I just hope that it does help the city. That's the plan, right? Opponents fought the MTA until the very end, storming the boardroom despite heightened police presence and barricades surrounding the building. He's on the yellow cab now. Among the protesters, yellow cab drivers who don't want their passengers to have to pay the extra fees. But with the MTA desperate for the $1 billion a year congestion pricing will bring in, the vote was overwhelmingly in favor, with just one member voting in opposition. My concern is a vibrant city coming out of COVID, the vacancy rate of office buildings, the major companies leaving New York and going south. The MTA hopes to start congestion pricing in June, but first it has to deal with lawsuits in New Jersey and New York. New Jersey Governor Phil Murphy said in a statement, this is far from over and we will continue to fight this blatant cash grab. And the MTA is also facing lawsuits from Rockland County, Staten Island, and a group of small business owners. The lawsuit brought on by New Jersey Governor Phil Murphy is scheduled for a hearing for next week. Reporting live on the West Side, Christina Fan, CBS 2 News. Christina, thank you.